welcome to the Den of Tools. Honey ho, guys and gals, it's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear, back again here in the old Den of Tools. Today is Monday, September 14th. You know what that means? It's time for Deals of the Week. We got some hot and spicy deals, but before we jump into that, got to show you some of the quick you know, hot deals that were showing up over on the Facebook group. If you're not a member on the Facebook group, and I know not a lot of you are fans of Facebook and whatnot, but this is, you know, you don't have to go and do anything else. You can just jump over to the Facebook group and check out these deals. We, uh, Jack here found the core 18 volt two tool combo kit there from Bosch for $99 was two fifty dollars marked down to 99 bucks. That's a heck of a steal. Let's see what else they found. We got the hyper tough. Yeah, this is the discount brand from, from Walmart, but still a 10 inch cordless chainsaw with battery and charger for $29. I mean, come on. And last but not least, well, I'm not going to taunt you with this. Can't flex on you too much, but we got the rigid two pack here in the brushless. We got the impact and the drill driver with two batteries, charger and a bag for $90, $90. That's better than a black Friday deal right there. But you know what? These, a lot of these, they're, they're in-store deals. You got to find them. They're going to be your mileage may vary, which means they might show up in some parts of the country, not in others. You got to be part of the group to jump on them quick because they disappear even faster. All right, now into the actual deals of the week. First thing we got over on Woot, we got the Metabo HPT. Remember, this Metabo HPT is what used to be called Hitachi. And, uh, you know, they got bought up by Metabo, but they're not, they didn't really integrate the brand. They just added it as a second tier to the actual Metabo line. But that's not bad because we got the Metabo HPT cordless drill driver here with two batteries with the charger, with the blow mold case and a small bit collection there, you know, whatever. But for $69, $70, it's called 70 bucks. It's 33 or 30% off, off of a hundred dollars. They do come with a lifetime warranty. Now let's be clear though, the, the Metabo HPT warranty, when they say lifetime there, what they actually mean is the lifetime of the tool, which is as long as they produce this tool until they change the model and replace it with another one, that's the what they consider the lifetime of the tool. So as long as they're making it, you can get it replaced, which is a pretty good deal when it comes to power tools. Still over at Woot, we got this thing. This is pretty cool. I've been looking for something like this. I may have to grab this myself. It's the Max Hall 70238 receiver mount hitch mounted crane with 1,000 pound capacity. So it doesn't stay permanently attached. You, you mount it to, uh, to your hitch as the third point for stabilization, which keeps it attached to the vehicle so it doesn't you know, tip over any of that other kind of stuff. You do have to set it up. It takes up, it's not the kind of thing you're gonna carry with you all the time. There's some other deals we've seen like that that mount to the bed and that kind of thing. But at 1,000 pound capacity, there's so many times where I was picking up some tools or some equipment, I could have used something like this. And for $170, that's 34% off the list price. That's a pretty good deal if you do a lot of this stuff as well. All right, over at Grizzly, again, no relation to the bear here, but the Grizzly Pro T31999 biscuit joiner. People are always asking me about biscuits. I mean, I love me a good biscuits. I'm more of a, a, a like a grand's kind of like the buttery flakiness of it. Oh, a little jam on there. Oh, yeah, so good. But if you're looking for a biscuit joiner, there's only a few options out there that are really reliable. And the Grizzly one is, I know a lot of woodworkers who use this. And uh, $89.95, I think that's kind of the standard price. But right now they're doing a deal where when you buy it, you get a free glue bottle and free pack of 175 biscuits to go with it. So it's a little bit of a deal there to go with it as well. Also, I want to point out this uh, the lumber rack system they have here. The Grizzly lumber rack, there's a bunch of people who sell this lumber rack system. Anytime you can find it for under $40, that's a pretty good deal. I had a system like this at our house in, uh, in California. It works great. When we set up the new shop, I'll probably do another one just like it uh then over at the home desk spot there we got the deals of the day of course they knew we we're doing deals of the day so they got us out the power tools and it's all dewalt combo kits again there's always too many to list i'll step through them real quick you can pause the video if there's one you want to take a look at yeah some of them are going to be sold out they go quick again this is until midnight tonight so you're going to want to jump on it fast all right i'll put a link to the whole thing so you can go through it and look at it for yourself Still over at Home Depot, this might be one of the hottest deals today. The Werner 22-foot reach aluminum 5-in-1 multi-position ladder. So this is like the little giant version from Werner. 22-foot reach, 
Again, for these ladders, what they, they rate them as how far you an average person standing on the designated top rung. Not the top top. We don't play that game here. But the designated top rung, you, that's how far you can reach with it, which is in this case is 22 feet. Werner makes, they're well known for making good quality ladders. This looks like a good quality setup. I've seen a, pretty much every one of these little uh, little giant knockoffs that are out there. And they're all, some are made better, some are, are not. This one I would say is at the top top tier of that this looks like one of the better constructed ones and for a hundred bucks you can't go wrong with that now we got a couple more here from home depot we look at this this that's why i said it might be because wow 109 dollars for the dewalt tough system this is the ds450 22 inch you get the base you get the box you get the top box all three of them there for 109 dollars now this is a special buy that ends by the end of day today if you want it when you're watching this video, this is Monday, again, 914. If you are after 914, then you should have subscribed and rung the bell. That's all I can say for you because that is a heck of a deal. That's better than Black Friday. I've never seen it that cheap before. Now, next up, we've got the, again, we got uh, the DeWalt 33-inch folding portable workbench for $69. Now, this is 30% off. That's a great price on this. I am going to say, however... <laughs> somebody sent me a great picture i wish you could find it where it says like this thing will hold a thousand pounds and they've got you know something like a bunch of concrete blocks on it and it's in the in the store display and it's collapsed <laughs> but that said it's a decent workbench it's got the nice peg holes for clamping and stuff but i still gotta say if i'm gonna spend you know that kind of money for a portable workbench i still think the heart right now is the best deal going you get the, the clamping system built into it. Yeah, it's incredibly sturdy. I don't know if it'll do a thousand pounds, but it is sixty-four dollars. So it's a couple bucks left. Comes with the clamps. I it just seems like a better and a definitely more sturdy system than the Dewalt. Because you look at the Dewalt, you know, on this the the legs are all the way out the edge. Let's see what they're on the Dewalt. See, they come in here. They're it, it just looks like a sturdier system there on, on that heart. All right, last one we got from the Home Depot here is the Makita Resip Saw with battery. And this is a five amp hour battery. Guys, if you don't know, Makita five amp hour batteries, they must be made out of unobtainium because they cost, I think the, the list price, not on sale, just for the battery is $150. I'm not joking. Makita batteries are not inexpensive, which means this is the LXT Lithium Brushless Resip Saw with 5.0 battery for for $200, that's a huge savings. If you're in the Makita line and you don't have this, you pick it up for the battery alone and you're, and you're getting a recip for 50 bucks. All right, JB Tools has, speaking of tools only here, JB uh, Tools has the DeWalt DCW600B. This is the 20 volt max XR. That means it's brushless, brushless cordless router tool. DeWalt makes some great routers, the smaller compact routers. And this is no different. And if you've been looking for a cordless one, you, you definitely want to go with brushless. So this is the one to get. There's $139 to $140 with free shipping. That's 60 bucks off the list price. Now over at Harbor Freight, these are not sale items. These are new items just released. They got us yet another of the Bauer polishers there for $90. And then this, this is a nifty little tool. It's not exactly a right angle. It's a close quarters drill. CQB, if you will. Uh, Three-eighths inch quarter, quarter close quarters drill there. Now they've had stuff kind of like this in the past. But uh, this is the upgrade for the new Bauer, and it looks pretty nifty. Now, one thing I want to talk about, some of you, we were talking about the live stream. Are you not, do you not follow the Sunday live streams? Why don't you show up for the Sunday live streams? Every Sunday, 6 p.m. Mountain Time, we do three hours of greets and meets and talks and all sorts of stuff, answer questions and whatnot. And I was looking up something for somebody else, and I stumbled across this at Harbor Freight. Talk, I can't believe how often. I mean, I've been through those stores a thousand times. We've been doing this channel here for five years, and I still find new tools over at Harbor Freight. High position motorcycle lift. I know nothing about this. This isn't a sale item. This is me actually asking you, do you have this tool? Have you used it? And what do you think about it? Because I see a lot of a lot of ideas that I could do with this. Uh, you know, maybe extending out the feet there, extending out the arms, using like a forklift kind of situation, use it as a lifting table, all sorts of cool stuff. Let me know what you think about it and if you've used it and if you think it's reliable. 
All right. Now, speaking of stuff that we do, can't forget to mention our shop here or the Teespring shop. That's the one that's associated with YouTube and whatnot. Usually you'll find it down below in the, under the video somewhere. But we got to have the, the bear mugs. Of course, we got the growler mask, the DOT t-shirt, and new for this season, we've added, because the Labrador requested it, we got the Den of Tools dog hoodies. Yeah, the missus made me do it. All right, moving on. <laughs> All right, I got to talk about this. This this one's personal experience right now. In fact, if you saw the live stream, we actually caught a mouse during the live stream. So it's the the temperature recently here in Montana dropped to below freezing, and all the mice decided that they're going to move into all the houses. I've been talking to all our neighbors, and all of us are having mouse issues right now. It's just what happens when you live in you know the country. I'd seen these before. They were a hot deal couple years back these these diving board style mouse traps and i've used other ones and and whatnot but the kids like hey let's try this one this will be cool and i like the idea of just being able to put out the bucket because when the mouse walks out on it it drops them in and it resets and you can just keep catching mice after mice allegedly yeah can you say eight mice that's how many we caught eight mice we've caught in total and there's one in the bucket right now i can hear him jumping around in the other room oh we're gonna i I see, now some people do fill them with water and dispose of the mouse quickly like that. The the cubs didn't want me to do that, so I said, "Well, we'll just take a bucket and we'll put it in the deep freeze, and they'll they'll just go to sleep." They they didn't like that either. So we went and released them into the wild, where I'm sure they're already snacks for owls and coyotes <laughs> or foxes. There's tons tons of red foxes around here. I'm sure, they thought it was a delicious treat. Anyway. I can't say enough about this, and they have a coupon right now when you apply it that takes an extra $5 off, so that's going to drop it from $19 down to uh, $14 if my math is correct, and half the time it isn't. See, 50% of the time, I'm right 100% of the time. All right, speaking of glue bottles, we talked about this. See, I own this glue bottle. I've purchased this back in 2016. If you do any glue ups, you got to get one of these glue bottles. They're fantastic. And they're on sale right now. Normally $8. They're on sale down for 6 So you're saving 25% off. That's good until the 16th. So you got a couple days to jump on that one. Uh, also over at Amazon, we got the Metabo grinder, four and a half inch grinder there. And it's normally uh, 50 bucks and it's on sale for $39 there. Uh, it's yeah, it's the corded, not the cordless, but Montabo makes some great grinders and that's a nice little basic solid grinder there. Now, also this is not exactly a tool, but man, it's normally $14, which seems insane. But if you're looking for some organization, small parts kind of stuff, these Klein tool bags, they're canvas zipper bags. They're not bad. They're normally $14 on sale, 36% off down to eight ninety seven. So you can grab some of those. Uh, let's see. We got, we got the, oh, I stumbled across this. I'm always looking for a good rotary tool accessory kit. And, you know, they're always kind of jumbled and they, they never stay. So this thing looks fantastic. This got to be one of the most complete uh, tool rotary tool kits I've ever seen. And it's on sale for, for or it's, sorry, it's normally $40. But they have a coupon where you can apply an additional 15% off. They'll knock that down. Uh, a good, I'm not even trying to do the math in my head. You can do the math in your head. All right, moving on. This thing. So I'm putting this in here because I just saw one of these. I'd heard about them, but I'd never actually seen one. And we get a lot of people coming through, kind of like campers and, you know, nature touristy types. And this guy, he had, um, uh, I think it was one of the big super, like the super Outback or something. He had one of those top boxes on it. And it was, you, you could tell it was difficult to you know, get stuff out of that top box. If you're not a really tall bear there, getting stuff out of there can be a real pain in the, you know what? So he pulls out one of these things and it clips right on to your, uh, to your, the, the latch for your door handle. When your door closes that little, uh, chrome silver looking, uh, D ring kind of thing there. And it latches onto that and gives you a nice steady step on it. And you can just climb right. He just hopped right up there, got stuff out. I was like, that is so cool. Uh, you know, I, I just, I guess I'd seen them or ads from, hadn't really realized how utilit and what kind of a utilitarian kind of thing they were. Now this one comes with a glass breaker on the end. Why you would include that to this tool? I don't know, but 
it's there, but it does fold up for easy storage. You can put it right in there as he did. He kept it. He kept it in the door, like the little cup holder in, in the door. Uh, you, I guess you could put it in your glove compartment or wherever, but anyway, there you go. As, as I said, that's how it connects right there. And you know, he hopped right up on that and for 20 bucks, not, I mean, if you got one of those top boxes or you use your top rack a lot, consider getting one of these. All right. Everbright. Now they sent me this light. Okay. And I was not having great expectations. I've seen a lot of headlamps and stuff. I got it here right in front of me. And I got to say, I was duly impressed with this thing. It is a very solid, I mean, it's plastic. Don't get me wrong, but it's a ruggedized plastic, really solid, uh, a setup on it and that the lights on this thing are wicked bright wicked bright and also as far as recharging it uses just a standard usb cable which i like rather than having some sort of special like you got to have this thing on it so that it will do the you know uh you know it uses their proprietary kind of thing i'm not a fan of that also it's got a little blinker light let me see if i can find a picture of it um on the back there, you can see it. The it's got a little uh, red blinker light on the back. You just tap, you tap it once. It's it's uh, solid on. You tap it twice, and it blinks. So it's kind of like a, you know, if someone's coming up behind you, you can still illuminate yourself in front, but uh, people will see you from behind in case you're jogging or something like that, or, ca or in case people are trying to follow you on the trail, that sort of stuff. This thing is very bright. It's solid. I, and I guess what I'm saying is for $17 and you get an extra 7% off when you apply the coupon, that, that, that's a no brainer to me. All right. Speaking to Amazon, I got to talk about this. There's a lot of great deals about Amazon basics out there and it may be tempting, but I think you should hold off for a little while. Casey missed the news. Uh, I don't know what that's about, but go away. Casey didn't miss the news. Um, these products are on fire. Like literally. Apparently, they have been going to some really cheap suppliers who have not built them to quite the quality level that they're supposed to. And it looks like the Senate and Congress are ordering uh, an investigation into Amazon and Amazon Basics because, uh, yeah, a lot of their products seem to be bursting into flames. So maybe hold off on buying anything Amazon Basics uh, that plugs in for a little while. Now, back over at Walmart, they're having a blowout sale, end of the season sale, if you will on their uh on some of their outdoor power equipment and of course you know maybe mowers aren't the biggest thing you want to pick up right now but blowers might be they're normally 154 dollars walmart sent me this or a heart i'm not sure if it's heart or walmart which department it actually was they might be the same thing for all i know they sent me this to test and the cubs have been using it all summer and as i tell people it's like holding a tiny hurricane in your hand it is fantastic get it fan blower come on people <laughs> i'm working hard up here anyway it's fantastic and at 138 dollars with the 40 amp uh you know uh battery on there 40 amp <laughs> 40 volt battery on there four amp hour uh life on it these things are great it it is without a doubt i've got probably half a dozen blowers at this time and it's the best blower it's the blower that unless i'm i'm just looking for space i'll grab the little job site blower but it's the blower that I always try to use because it is just that powerful. Um, and anyway, so it's marked down. Expect to see a lot of other right now. Outdoor power equipment's going to start going on sale. I know you don't want to think about next summer and whatnot, but now's the time to buy. All right. Over at Lowe's, if you're looking for the 20 volt stuff, if you're in the cobalt line, I have this too. And the kids have been using this also. Why? Because there's sometimes you don't want all that kind of power, especially when it comes to the trimmers. And they use this for a lot of the detail work when they're when they're doing lawns. $129 for the combo. I know I've shown this before. I can't say enough. I'm a huge fan of the Cobalt line in general. So if you're planning to pick up some of the other tools, you get the 4 amp hour battery and charger with this. Plus you get the blower and you get the trimmer. It, it, they're not monsters like the Hart 40 volt stuff are, but they're, they're just fine. They work. They do. All right, now we got some really special deals there. Kind of, there's again going to be, your mileage may vary, but this is for all of you who are really excited or at least still excited or into the Porter Cable tool line. Now, Porter Cable has become, yes, the redheaded stepchild of Stanley Black & Decker. They got their new hotness with Craftsman. And of course, DeWalt's always their big, you know, cash cow. And Black & Decker is just, well, 
he he shows you know they're, they're like the the youngest son that nobody really knows where he is and what he's doing i don't know he's doing something out in the yard who cares but porter cable is, is the unloved middle sibling who got pushed aside for craftsmen and they kind of you know lowe's is now getting rid of them and that's what's going on so this was their big for lowe's this was their comparison their their alternative to the middle of the road stuff over at home depot which is rigid this was supposed to be on par direct competitor to rigid and it's getting phased out now are they going is stanley black and decker going to drop it we don't know at this point they've been selling it to uh, lower tier, uh, like Ace and other small hardware stores, independent hardware stores. It's the brand you can now, if you've got a smaller independent store, you can pick up and have it as your house brand to show that you carry quality professional level equipment. That said, okay, enough of that. So these are going on sale for, let's see, MSRP on this is 60, $63. They're showing up in the 20s. Now, I've only checked a few area codes. Like this is down in, uh, in Las Vegas. And I currently, I don't think there's any in stock down there. Are there? I thought I did. Let's do check inventory on it. I thought I'd already run that. Maybe not. And inventory says $59. Okay. So no sales there. Now I will point out this. If you're desperate to pick one up on Amazon, you can get them for a few bucks cheaper on Amazon. And I'll have links to the Amazon option below. But we've got the jigsaw and they are showing up in some places for in the $20 range. Uh, let me see if I can scroll down here and find some of the other ones. Here's the saw showing up for uh, the Cirque saw there for $29, so $30. Uh, the Recip saw for $30. And the Jigsaw there, 5% of stores are showing this for $30. Now, we got the, here's the Recip I was talking about before. On Amazon, it's $55. Third party on Amazon's $45, but you probably got to pay more in shipping. Um, and then we've got also... The Cirque saw there as well. Now, this was showing up. I was able to find one store in Las Vegas that has this for $29. So, again, there, there are stores out there that do have this. Last but not least, we've got the, uh, the brushless cordless drill driver. This is a nice, actually pretty nice drill. The battery system is a little expensive, and that's one of the reasons why I'm not a huge fan of most of the Stanley Black & Decker stuff. But if you're in it or you're looking for a discount, if you're looking for a discount system and you don't mind piecing it together and you're never really going to expand it, Porter Cable might be an option for you. Normally $134, and it's showing up 50% off in stock at this location here for $69.50. Other locations have it for more, but again, We'll have a link to this. This website's called BrickSeek, and you can, all you do is you go to the link here, you enter in your zip code, it tells you where it is. Again, I'll also have the links to Amazon. Now, as far as some bonus items for you, we got the Anchor wireless power bank. I'm a huge fan of the Anchor system. They have lots of great products. Uh, I have Anchor and I have Aki. I go back and forth depending on whichever one's on sale. I like them both. Here we got this one for $35.99. That's $36 there. And uh, it, it is a fabulous, and it, if I'm not mistaken, it also does the cordless. So if you want, you just set your phone right down on it. If you have the wireless charging and it will charge it right there. And this is a 10,000 milliamp battery charger. It's pretty nice there. And last but not least, the bear's got to show you his favorite, which is some honey. We got raw unfiltered honey here. Oh, it's so tasty there for only $9. Come on. That's only point. What was that? 22 cents an ounce. This is the best seller in honey here on amazon so i thought i i could share with you in fact you can subscribe and save you do that they'll send you honey every month just, just think about it. every month getting a box of honey how how great is that <laughs> what a wonderful world we live in anyway that's all the bear has for you today were there any steals and deals that the bear missed why don't you put them down below put a link to them if you can if not you can always email me at uh red at denatools.com and i will be happy to post it for you make sure you go over to the facebook group we also have a reddit group as well uh check us out on well we're no longer on twitter i guess we're on twitter i don't know but uh instagram we have it's red and crew on instagram we're trying to do more stuff over there anyway till next time you all take care god bless and as always shine on